Hey guys, someone asked me to um, figure out how to make custom text come up on your lock screen like this. Um, so basically, uh, I tried to figure that out on my own, and I did find out the files that you needed to get it. So I wanted to show you guys how to do it. First, you're gonna have to go into your Cydia. All right. So one sec. So when you go into Cydia, you're gonna want to add these sources cydia.touch-mania.com and repo.sinfuliphone.com and then once you get those you want to get you want to get ifile and slide to unlock killer um, <clears throat> you can actually get um, the ifile from cydia.touch-mania but they make you pay for it so I found one on I found a cracked version on the repo.sinfuliphone so you guys don't have to pay for that. Um, when you do this, when you get iFile, it's basically just like SSHing into your <laughs> files, but um, you can do it from your iPod itself. So it's really useful if you just want to edit files. But if you if you want to add files from your computer to your iPod, you are going to have to SSH to, into it. And for that, you're going to need WinSCP. And if you guys don't know how to do that, how to get that, just look at my other videos. So here, um, just going to manage sources. And then, as you can see, I have um, cydia.touch-mania right there, and then the repo.sinfuliphone.com. So you go into search, and then you search iFile. And if you added this is correctly, you should get the iFile in the blue text and the iFile, iFile cracked. Get the, um, the cracked one. I already have it installed, so that's why it says modify, but install it on yours. And then go and get slide to un I think I spelled that wrong. Slide to unlock killer. And that's this one right here. It's gonna be a tweak. This actually goes into your um winter board, so you're gonna need winter board for this too. And then once you get that, those two, you can go back to your home screen and you should get this app um, on your springboard somewhere that will say that it's called iFile I have it in my dock so it's going to look something like this so go into that right and then give it a second to load I already did it so it's um, it's already kind of in all the way so let me just back out of it all the way again okay so one more. Okay, so when you go into it, um, back out all the way till you get to the, the slash. So slash, and then you go into var. From that, scroll down until you get to stash. So that's right here, going to stash. Okay, and then go into your themes. From there, go into entriage killer dot theme and then folders and then springboard and then choose the language that you're running it with so I'm just gonna run it in English so choose en dot iproj that one and then go to springboard not strings and it's gonna bring this up now if you want to you can also change a bunch of things here um, I actually have a website pulled up so let me just minimize this and pull this one up. Here's a list, all this stuff. Um, so the first one, let me pull this one up too. Okay, so like the very first one is your customized phrase for your alarm clock. The second one is going to be your slide to unlock text. So I have it set as Mr. G Siv, my YouTube channel, and then the power. The um the power off text is going to be the power down lock label, and then the slide to cancel is your slide to cancel syncing text, right? Slide to cancel right here. So um if you want to edit it, you hit the edit button, and then you just click what you want to edit, and then you just type. So I I already have it set as Mr. Jesus. So I don't really want to change it. So whatever you just hit save. Then done, 
and then it'll take you back here and then hit your home button and it'll take you back to your springboard and now what you want to do is you want to go into your um, your winter board so let me just go into winter board real quick oops wrong button okay and then themes okay and it's going to come up like this now you want to en enable and triage killer and when you enable that um, it'll respring so um, I don't want to do that so it'll respring and then um, you um, let me, you hit the top left power button whatever it'll go into sleep mode or whatever you call it and then when you bring it back up um, it should say whatever your text was so it's not much but I think it's kinda cool how you can change the text so just unlock it and there you go alright that's about it for this video um, check out my other videos alright that's about it this is Mr. GSIV see ya Beyond the boundaries of your city's lights